China is making waves in the space industry with a bold new move, launching its very first rocket recovery drone ship, Xingji Guiang. This cutting-edge vessel is designed to rival SpaceX's reusable rocket technology and could reshape how we approach space travel. In this video, we'll dive into the significance of this ship, how it works, and what it means for the future of space exploration. China has officially entered the race for reusable rockets with the launch of Xingji Guiang, a state-of-the-art drone ship developed by iSpace, a private aerospace company based in Beijing. This launch positions China as only the second country, after the United States, to possess such advanced technology for recovering rocket stages at sea. The ship is a clear move to challenge SpaceX, the pioneer in this field, and offers a glimpse into the future of more affordable and sustainable space travel. The Xingji Guiheng is designed to recover the first stage boosters of rockets, similar to how SpaceX uses drone ships to land the first stage of its Falcon 9 rockets after launch. This capability is crucial for reducing the costs of space travel, as reusing rocket stages reduces the expense of building new ones for each launch. The Xingji Guiheng is built to recover rockets launched by multiple providers, not just iSpace, which expands its role in China's space program. The vessel itself is impressive, measuring 100 meters in length and 42 meters in width. These dimensions make it larger than SpaceX's autonomous spaceport drone ship, ASDS, which is 91 meters long. The Xingji Guiheng is equipped with a recovery deck measuring 40 meters by 60 meters, offering more than enough space to safely catch the descending rocket boosters. This design ensures that the ship can handle the precise landing requirements of the rockets even in challenging sea conditions. The launch of Xingji Guiheng is part of China's broader strategy to reduce the cost of space exploration and strengthen its commercial space sector. By following in SpaceX's footsteps, China aims to boost its space industry with a mix of state and private sector investments, just as the U.S. did to foster SpaceX's growth. The launch of this drone ship is an important milestone that signals China's intent to challenge the dominance of SpaceX in the space industry. In the coming years, China's ability to land and reuse rocket stages will play a pivotal role in its long-term space ambitions. The technology powering the Xingji Guiheng drone ship is a critical aspect of its success. Equipped with a dynamic positioning system, DPS, the ship can precisely adjust its position to align with the descending rocket booster. This system is similar to what SpaceX uses for its drone ships. Ensures that the vessel remains in the right position, even when faced with strong winds, waves, and other challenging conditions. This technology is essential for safely landing a rocket booster at sea. When a rocket is launched, it must reach high altitudes before returning to Earth, often in a horizontal trajectory. The booster requires enough fuel to return to a designated landing site, which is why SpaceX often uses drone ships in the ocean for Falcon 9 launches. The Xingji Guiheng will play a similar role for China's rockets, including the SQX-3, a large reusable launch vehicle set to undergo its first flight test by the end of 2025. The Xingji Guiheng measures 100 meters in length, making it larger than the autonomous spaceport drone ship, ASDS, used by SpaceX. Despite being slightly larger, the Xingji Guiheng's deck is just as capable of handling the massive size of rocket boosters, with a 40-meter by 60-meter recovery area. This makes the ship highly versatile, as it can recover multiple types of rocket stages, not just those from iSpace. In addition to the dynamic positioning system, the Xingji Guiheng features advanced navigation tools that allow it to operate in sea state 4 and 5 conditions with challenging ocean conditions, including waves up to 2.5 meters in height and winds ranging between 17 to 21 knots. This ensures the vessel's capability to land rockets in a variety of weather conditions, which is crucial for successful missions. The ship also features an intelligent unmanned operation mode, which reduces the need for manual intervention ensuring a higher level of safety and reliability during recovery operations. This mode is a key aspect of the ship's design, enabling autonomous operations that minimize the risk to human crew members while enhancing the overall efficiency of the recovery process.
The launch of Xinji Guihang is not just a technical achievement, it represents a key step in China's broader space strategy. The ability to recover and reuse rocket stages will dramatically lower the cost of space launches, which is essential for China's plans to become a global leader in space exploration. By reducing costs, China can increase the frequency of its space missions, making space more accessible for a variety of commercial, scientific, and national objectives. One of China's most ambitious projects is the development of its low-orbit internet constellation. This vast network of satellites will provide internet access to remote areas worldwide and help China expand its presence in space. To launch and maintain this constellation, China needs an efficient, cost-effective launch system, and the introduction of Xinji Guihang is crucial for achieving this goal. In the near term, the Xinji Guihang will support the recovery of the SQX-3 rocket, which is designed for heavy payload missions. The SQX-3 will be capable of launching large payloads into space, and with reusable technology, the cost of these launches will be significantly lower. This is particularly important for the development of China's low-orbit satellite network, which will require frequent, affordable launches. Longer term, the Xinji Guihang will also play a role in supporting China's ambitions for lunar exploration, Mars missions, and even crewed space travel. By perfecting reusable rocket technology, China will be able to take on more complex missions while ensuring the sustainability of its space program. The strategic implications of this move extend far beyond just launching rockets. It positions China as a key player in the growing global space economy. Furthermore, by creating partnerships with private companies like iSpace, China is fostering innovation in the commercial space sector. This collaboration between state and private entities mirrors the approach that SpaceX and the U.S. have successfully adopted, paving the way for more efficient, collaborative, and cost-effective space missions in the future. This milestone not only advances China's space capabilities, but also signals its determination to shape the future of global space exploration and technology leadership. The launch of Xinji Guihang marks a major milestone in China's rise as a global space power. This advanced drone ship showcases China's commitment to cutting space exploration costs and ensuring sustainable missions. By recovering and reusing rocket stages, China is transforming the space industry. With ambitious goals like low-orbit satellite constellations and exploration missions, China is making space more accessible and affordable. Stay tuned for updates on how China's reusable rocket technology is shaping the future of space exploration. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries, and don't forget to leave a comment below. Also, you can visit our website, spaceinews.com. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.